Good afternoon. Um, I'm happy to have this opportunity to talk with you today. And I, Evelyn, and today I would like to introduce you a great actress, Kate Blanchett, and uh, what I learned from her in the video of Inside the Actor Studio. And so I would like to give you a brief introduction of Kate Blanchett first. And Kate Blanchett is an Australian art actress and theatre director. She was born on 1969 in Melbourne and she was the middle of children in her family with an elder brother and a younger sister. And uh, her father died of a, a heart attack when she was only 10. And in the video, she said that she still remember that morning she was playing piano while her father waved goodbye to her for the last time. And she felt very sad that uh, she didn't embrace him that day. So after that, she thought that she should kiss everyone goodbye before leaving the house. And about her acting career, Kate was graduated from National Institute of Dramatic, Dramatic Art and when in college she had already played lots of roles and she came to international attention uh, for her role as Elizabeth I of England in 1998 film Elizabeth, for which she won the, uh, the Golden Globe Award and earned her first Academy Award for Best Actress nomination, and then her portrayal of Catherine Halpern in The Aviator brought her critical acclaim, acclaim and many accolades, including the Academy Award for Best Actress in a Supporting Role, and making her the only actor to win an Oscar for portraying another Oscar-winning actor. And in 2013, she starred as Jasmine French in Ruby Allen's Blue Jasmine for which she won numerous accolades, including the Academy Award for Best Actress. And this is a brief introduction of Kate Blanchett. And next, I would like to talk about uh, what I learned in the video. And it's about her attitude uh, toward acting and how she be become, how she makes herself become the characters and how she works with directors and other people in her clue. And uh, Kate is really a hard-working actress and she uh, put out her efforts to make herself become the characters. And she says she thinks that the more one works in film, the more she realizes that she has to engage and be curious in the whole process of filmmaking. And when asked what her homework consists of, she said that she always put everything neatly on the desk, but ends, ends up on the floor. So it means it shows that uh, she really engaged in her work, and she uh, really uh, like uh, put lots of effort to make herself become the character. And she said that uh, she was more interested in the character than she was in herself. And she always thinks that what she needs to do to fit the, uh, need to do is to fit the character, not how to make the characters fit herself. So uh, I think it is really uh, it is very important that if you uh, try to make the character fit yourself, uh, the character will think very like yourself. So. Uh, what you need to do is to try to understand your character and make yourself become the characters. Uh, so I think it is also why at the beginning of the video, Kate describes herself as part extrovert and part wallflower, and she thinks that it is a myth that uh, actors are all extroverts because she thinks that some, some actors are rather shy and uh, something just happened before five minutes they go on stage, they can transform themselves, uh, becomes their character. And so, uh, and about how Kate uh, works with uh, other people in the crew and how, uh, how she works with uh, directors, and she says that she was not an actor who detected everything because she thought it was better for a group of people finding ways to work together and she she loved to have a discussion with other people and she uh, embraced all kind of possibility and um, and also when asked what ideally she wanted from director she said that we have expectation in relationship it leads to disappointment so she thought people always need to find out uh, what people think and when people have opposite 
perspectives, it can lead to interesting responses and on the contrary, when people have similar perspectives, it often makes the result quite monochromatic. So, uh, and she also says that she doesn't want to tie everything up before she performs it. She wanted to leave it open and uh, to what happened to the moment. And um, so, uh, and Kate also says that uh, for actors, it's hard to just be yourself and feel your own thing. And she thought it was very important to connect with audience. So, uh, so in order to connect with audience, you need to. Uh, you need to take lots of things into consideration, and you need to understand what other people thought, other people think. And uh, so, in conclusion, uh, what I learned from Kate is that you really need to uh, love your work, engage in it, and uh, to make yourself become this character, and uh, and to uh, have uh, enough discussion with other people in your crew. And uh, this is the end of my presentation, and thank you for your listening. <laughs>